One of my neighbors has an old brush hog and it takes this shape of blade, but they couldn't get ones with the right size hole to fit these bolts. So I need to make that hole bigger. Um, it's about inch and three eighths now and needs to go up to inch and a half. So I'm gonna put it in the milling machine and we're gonna bore it out to inch and a half. Well, I was gonna try to put this in the same spot as the other one, but it's really pretty far off. Um, so I'm gonna recenter it. Left and right it seems okay. I could use the coaxial indicator to get that even closer, but it's a punched hole right now, just punched in the steel. So it does not have to be particularly, well, it's not particularly precise now.
So I'm at 400 thousandths now, or 1.4. I need to get to 1.5. Got a ways to go. I'm taking about 20 thousandths per pass. Seems to be working okay. There's a fair amount of spring in the tool setup. Um, and it chatters a little bit, but. Surface finish is not critical. Could be, I mean, this one was punched. It could be drilled, could be anything. Well, drilling just a little bit bigger than this would be a real pain in the neck. Um, so, boring it, I guess, is the way to go. At least with the tooling that I have. <laughs> Could probably try a slightly slower spindle speed, but that belt, that um, pulley has a notch out of it. So it kind of works, but I'd rather not run that until I get it fixed. So, in the meantime, we're stuck with, with this setup. The other thing that's not helping my chattering cause is this. It's not quite parallel, so it doesn't really clamp well on the vise. It's fatter down on this end. There we go. It fits in nicely now, all ready to get mounted on the machine. Um, pretty rough or imprecise machining job needed, but to drill that out any, I mean, you could torch it out, you could do all sorts of other st stuff, grind it, but yeah, if you got the milling machine, it, it worked pretty well. Um, could use slightly different tooling. Having a better boring bar would have worked. Straightening this out, there's a little burr on this end, which is what it was clamping on in the vise. Um, would have held it more rigidly, but it's good enough for a brush hog, that's for sure.